While Steve Jobs and Steve Wozniak are widely recognized as the co-founders of Apple Incorporated, another key figure in the company's early days remains relatively unknown. Ronald Wayne, the forgotten co-founder, played a critical role in Apple's founding, but left the company before it achieved monumental success. In this exploration, we delve into 10 lesser-known facts about Ronald Wayne, shedding light on the man who opted for a different path in the tech world. 1. Founding Apple with Jobs and Wozniak Ronald Wayne was an essential part of the trio that co-founded Apple in 1976. He contributed to the creation of the first Apple logo and drafted the original partnership agreement. 2. Equity Stake and Departure Wayne initially held a 10% equity stake in Apple, a share that would be worth billions today. However, fearing potential financial risks, he sold his shares back to Jobs and Wozniak for just $800, missing out on the tremendous wealth that followed. 3. Role as Adult Supervision Wayne, a decade older than Jobs and Wozniak, played the role of the adult supervision in the early days of Apple. His experience in engineering and drafting as well as his business acumen, provided a stabilizing influence. 4. Creation of the first Apple logo. Wayne designed the first Apple logo, featuring Sir Isaac Newton sitting under an apple tree. This logo, though short-lived, reflected Wayne's artistic contributions to the company's early branding. 5. Disagreements and decision to leave. Wayne's departure from Apple was prompted by concerns about potential financial liabilities. Fearful of the risks involved in running a business, he decided to sell his shares and leave the company just 12 days after its founding. 6. Post-Apple Career After leaving Apple, Wayne continued to work in various engineering and technology-related roles. His decision to depart Apple did not deter his passion for innovation. 7. Author and Historian Wayne authored a memoir, Adventures of an Apple Founder, in which he shares his experiences with Apple and his perspective on the tech industry's evolution. 8. Brief Return to Apple In the 1990s, Wayne briefly returned to Apple, working as a technical writer. His return was a symbolic connection to the company he had helped found decades earlier. 9. Personal Tragedy and Resilience Wayne faced personal tragedies, including the loss of his home in a flood. Despite these challenges, he exhibited resilience and continued to pursue his passions. 10. Limited Recognition Despite Contributions Despite his contributions to the founding of Apple, Wayne remains a relatively obscure figure in tech history. His decision to leave the company early on has led to limited recognition of his role in shaping the tech giant's beginnings. As we unveil these lesser-known facets of Ronald Wayne's life, a narrative of a man who played a pivotal role in Apple's early days, yet chose a different trajectory emerges. Wayne's contributions, both artistic and practical, are etched in Apple's history, though his departure at a critical juncture resulted in a limited acknowledgement of his role. Understanding these hidden aspects adds depth to the story of a co-founder, whose path diverged from the iconic success that Apple achieved.